hi guys welcome to another video so in this video we're gonna show you how you can add multiple numbers that comes under one single uh, FB business portfolio so for, for in your case you have a business uh, that you are running you need multiple numbers for different use cases one for support or one for demo like you have you have a need of uh, add multiple numbers so this video we will show you how easily you can set it up so first thing uh, set up your account with us then go to whatsapp cloud then click on connect whatsapp cloud so we, we're gonna add the first number that we go, we want to use so go uh, if you are already logged in uh, this option will show if you are not logged in to the current account make sure you are logged into the account that you have access for the business manager so let's continue and uh, get started so here let me select the business that i want so this is the business that we are uh, gonna use today so let's click on nest here uh, we don't have any uh, whatsapp accounts connected or created before so it will be empty so make sure uh, it's it all already selected as create a whatsapp account let's click on nest now here we need to provide a name for the waba account so let me put rapid pod uh, rb tutorials so this will give us an idea uh, what this number or what this waba name so this is for our support so i'm gonna create uh, for the support like this so category uh, it's more like an educational kind of uh, a small business so we're gonna select the category as it is uh, then click on nest now the waba has been creating we are creating now here you can provide the number if your business has already been verified meta will give you the option to use a free number but in in our case this business is not verified so we have to uh, pro use the uh, the number that we want to connect uh, so i have put the number uh, let's pay uh, cross check it okay let me go to the next step so uh, here uh, facebook uh, meta will check whether there is an existing number or account created or not if not uh, you will get this option to receive otp so i have received an otp let's go with that let me click on this so the otp was verified so let's continue click on continue and uh, let's wait for this process to get completed so you will get an option like this uh, then click on finish so you can click on sync numbers here so here uh, your number is there you can activate this so this is a waba name that we created for our reference what exactly this waba number we are using so that for our reference we can see that as well so here you can see go to health check uh, do an health check first here you can see a uh, couple of things are uh, limited because this business is not verified that is why there will be some limitations the other thing is uh, payment uh, gateway uh, or like a payment method is not connected means if you want to do a whatsapp template notifications or something that is not possible the uh, that is why that is blocked uh, if you want this thing to be enabled you need to add a, a payment method to the waba that you created so that uh, it will uh, uh, remove this uh, error so that we will cover in a different video in this video we're not going to talk about that also the other thing is you need to register the number then only this error will be lifted and the number will be active so let's do one thing uh, let's uh, click on phone numbers as well uh, it will directly take you to the waba here you can see the status is pending so we need to register the number so click on this three dot click on register number and click on yes let's wait for this to done like you will if there is no errors you will get the success message again you can click on health check here you can see uh, the number status uh, that error has been gone uh, also if you go back to your uh, whatsapp manager 
here you can see the number has been connected so we connected one number now we need to connect another number so what you can do uh, in this situation uh, if you want to connect uh, one more number that you need uh, in the same workspace so what uh, two things you can do you can create a new workspace and do the same process with the new number or you can click on disconnect on the same workspace click on the connect whatsapp cloud again and uh, continue get started the same process you can repeat select the business manager account what you need what you want then click on next again and here you can see this is the number that we just created uh, the WABA account that we created so you, in your case you want to add a new number uh, if it uh, the new number you want to add to the same WABA then you can go with this step if you want to create a new WABA like for example for a different use case for uh, sales or something like that for sales uh, or marketing purpose you want a different WABA itself uh, that also you can do you can decide so for now we are going with this option we are creating a entirely a new waba and uh, you can click on nest and you can give a name so for this is for our sale for the business sales purpose so let's uh, create uh, uh, a waba title so that it will be uh, useful to uh, see uh, as a reference and uh, the business uh, name should be the, the name as it should match with the profile the uh, uh, what you uh, what's your business portfolio uh, title it should be matching according to that so that is why we are not changing that keeping as it is uh, so let's click on nest so now uh, input the new number that we want to connect so uh, this is the another number that we are planning to connect for this whatsapp automation so this is a number let's click on nest yeah so an, an otp has been sent let's wait uh, i i have got the otp now let me input that so the uh, new otp is here let me click nest continue so uh, that's it like let me finish this process it's successful so let's click on save numbers so now it will uh, automatically get the two numbers that we uh, already uh, connected in the same verbal so what you can do is click sync numbers uh, it should be uh, synced once again the new uh, number that we connected is this one uh, same thing we need to do uh, probably uh, the OTP uh, authentication is failed I mean we we haven't registered the number so here you can see if you click on phone numbers its status will be pending so that we need uh, first thing first you need to register the number click on yes So the number has been successfully registered so if you go back here if you reload the whatsapp manager you can see the status is high so i mean connected and quality is okay also checked high so it's uh, it's fine ready to use so now what you can do you can uh, connect a port and you can start building your chatbot uh, for the business so based on your plan uh, so you can see if you go back to dashboard you can see the uh, according to your plan you will only have one bot that you can create so here you can only create one bot so for example let's create a, a bot. let's activate this channel uh, let's do the same uh, let me activate the other channel as well so now uh, let's create one sample bot So you have reached the limit so you will get this error because we have uh, two uh, we, we already have an existing bot connected here so let's kind of let's uh, let me go back to because it's on omni channel we already have a bot connected let me delete this uh, 
let me go here and let me create a new bot so now the bot has been created and connected to that particular whatsapp channel now let's open the flow let's do a simple uh, bot flow test let's say uh, uh, hello world something let's print this message uh, let's print this message let's publish it uh, let's preview uh, this on whatsapp so here you can see we can see uh, we are receiving messages uh, even if i type something the same thing will keep showing hello world let's go back and here if you go to live chat you can see the conversation coming through from the user so uh, now for the second number if you do the same uh, go to cloud if you try to create uh, you will get the error because uh, by default uh, in your workspace you already reached the limit if you want to do uh, another bot you need to buy an add-on so if you go to the billing so you, you already reached the limit you want extra bot so what you can do is uh, manage add-ons uh, which add-on you want you want an extra bot so go go to that and click on add add-ons currently you will not have any add-ons because your points uh, you can click on your points it will be zero so make sure uh, you purchase exact points that you want for example for an extra bot you can see it's five dollar per month which means five points you needed every month it's like a valid system you can choose the add-on that you want make sure uh, if you are from uh, india or uh, if you're making the purchase make sure to select that particular add-on in inr if you are outside india you can go with the dollar uh, this uh, you can make the purchase like that in the currency whatever currency that available you can purchase it that's it that's it for the video so in the like uh, like we said uh, so with this tutorial uh, you can add multiple numbers under same business in one single workspace so if you have any questions or if you have any doubt or any trouble uh, facing you can reach out to our support and uh, you can raise a ticket thank you